What's it? What's the name of the? This is Little Bit. She's actually. Is that? Uh, she's actually an adult. How old is, is that baby. little baby? She's uh, seven months. She's gonna be breeded, bred next month. What does he eat? Uh, this is alfalfa. Nervous. Where you guys headed? Oh <laughs> uh, well, I actually have a traveling farm called Tink's Traveling Farm, and uh, I've got chickens and ducks. And I teach people how to live sustainably on, on, on you know, being able to travel. And oh, how really? They, how they raise animals and treat animals. And, like, <laughs> this one's going to be bred, so she'll be a mama. I guess, ma'am. Oh, you yeah, can say hello to Hey, friendly. baby. <laughs> what a sweet baby. Rescue. So. Oh, you I, rescued her. Yeah, when I first got her, she was smaller than a chicken. You sure are sweetie. <laughs> Thank you, Angel. You have a great day. Yes, ma'am. You too, darling. <laughs> cabin. I don't have any doubt it's like a prospector's cabin, like abandoned a claim, a gold claim I'm thinking of. Because it's got some markers there with an initial. Let's take a look at this. This was someone who uh, was uh, looking for gold out here prospecting. So I don't know, let's see. Just a point of interest, that's all. How old is this? How old could this possibly be? Look at this. Had his little outhouse, see? Don't it make me see, things last a long time in the desert. You get up in the morning, there's no dew here in the desert. Yeah, it just collapsed. You come back 50 years, it'll still be here. And you know what this is? That was his wood burning stove, or hers. This is a, a claim stake right here. This particular structure appears to be they were trying to mine. Now that's what I think, I don't know. I make a lot of assumptions on these kind of trips because I don't know, you know. Actually look like it's been maybe filled in. But uh, this is the Dome Rock area. It's public land, but it's day use only. No camping out here. Well, no overnight camping. I find stuff like this so interesting. We look for these out of the way places, these places like this. And they're all over. We had a kitchen here. Pardon me? Kitchen here. This metal thing. And then this pipe going out. Yeah, that was for the stove. A fireplace over there. Oh, a fireplace. Look. And some shelves. In another little room. Yeah, some shelving over there. Yeah, so look. They made a kitchen there. And guess what they made the walls out of? Local material. Rocks. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, there's another room back there. It's actually a, a three-room structure. That may be a cellar. <laughs> that may be. A, yeah, I don't know what that is. But awesome, man. You know, somebody enjoyed having this. Yeah, part of it underground here. Cool. No, I'm not going in there. Probably full of bats, snakes. <laughs> and uh, a big old sack of gold, right? No, I don't think so. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's been investigated. <laughs> it is here. And he, he built this little structure here. This little bankman here. Then he decided the guy had bed bugs. <laughs> so, uh, that. Shaving cream on one this cold day. No I think we'll go down this way a little bit. See what's down this road. You don't know until you make the trip. We're going down this way. We just spoke with a guy and he told us there's a gold mine down here. We're going to take a look. Okay. Let's go see. Maybe, maybe not. I think the dirt one. Scooter, he 
just get so excited if we take these trips. <laughs> so we use full picture. Let's see what this is. It's up here. Oh, to prospect. Let's see what it says here. Uh, you need a badge to prospect. Oh, okay. Quartzite Metal Detector Club, QMDC. Oh, okay. this is private property that I, I would have to assume. You can drive down here, but you can't metal detect. You can't metal detect. Okay. Mm -hmm. Metal camp claim for that club. I guess it identifies different areas of the camp. Okay. Well, we got to the end of the road here, and that way we can't go that far. But it's really sweet out here. Spring bloom is beginning to uh, show itself. Yeah. like a place you'd see in the movies. Incidentally, you see this in the desert quite a bit. It's the creole soaked uh, vegetation. I got a very unique defense system. And that is if any other plant gets near them, their roots will go uh, toward that plant and uh, capture all the water so that plant can't live. He These are very go. healthy looking creole soaks here. Skitter wants Digging for gold here. You come out here, you have to be careful about rattlesnakes. They are out. We've seen some photographs of some really huge rattlesnakes that have come out in the last couple of weeks. And they are camouflaged too. That little old scooter. He, He's always he so happy. He all the way up there. He's such a happy little fella. Great disposition. Always happy. He's buried. What is that, a cross over there? Come on. Let's go take a look. Let's investigate. What is that? Let's go over here. We got a... It's either a grave marker or uh, a claim marker or something else. Watch for snakes, you guys. Something buried there. Watch out. Somebody <laughs> kicked the bucket.
we are out here by ourselves. But this is something that you would see in the movies. It truly is. It is just beautiful. What's this? Anaconda. Huh? Anaconda. Anaconda. <laughs> <laughs> Cindy said it's an anaconda. <laughs> There's an old sluice. Sluice contraption. They put the uh, ore or the dirt in there, then they pull water. They wash the gold all the way down to the bottom, see? Somebody killed this snake here. It's uh, the green sewer anacondas. Cindy and I were camping outside of uh, Big Bend National Park in Texas. And uh, we were looking out the windows like seven o'clock. It was starting to get a little, a little dark. And this group or sound or herd, I don't know what you call them, of javelinas just came screaming out of the mountains. And uh, I'd never seen anything like that. And then not long after that, we see these coyotes running around. And, uh, <laughs> all around the campsite, man. Oh, what a trip. Photo bomb. <laughs> Scooter photo bombed you. <laughs> I want to get over in there because it's rattlesnake season. Rattlesnake season. But look at this thing. Look at that. Isn't that awesome? Yeah, you don't see these very often in this state of uh, vegetation. Uh, it's got really sharp thorns on it. Man, I mean sharp. I think it's called Ocatillo, right? Yeah, they'll be shooting out a big flower at the tip of each one of those soon. They do what? A huge red flower will pop out at the very tip of each one of these. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, they're beautiful. Yeah. It's really something. If anyone gives you any grief, then uh, send them a... Uh, Picture of this. Okay. <laughs> okay. 